channel means we're aiming to get to 100,000 subscribers. If you enjoy my videos, don't forget to hit that sub button if you'd like to help us get there. Enjoy the video! Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for coming by to another video on my channel, I really do appreciate it. And before we get started, I just wanted to remind you guys, don't forget to go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, it is completely free. And at the moment, around 60% of my audience that watch these videos aren't actually subscribed, you guys. And we are so close to hitting 100,000 subscribers, it would really mean a lot to me if you could take a moment to just hit that sub button. Anyways you guys, today we are going to go over every single thing that is going to be coming in the new summer update very very soon or at least everything that we know so far i imagine there will be some secret things we don't already know about because you know the devs love to be secretive and surprise us with things and also i also want to talk to you guys a little bit about the spring halo 2021 giveaway that is going to be happening very very soon before all of that though let's go ahead and say hi to dolly and also say thank you to today's little bean shout out Hey everyone, I'm Dolly and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for this special little bean shout out. Thank you so much for commenting on the last video. You are super awesome. And of course, if you want to be the next little bean shout out, all you have to do is leave a comment down below with hashtag LBS at the end of your comments so we know that you'd like to be showcased. And a massive thank you to everybody who's been sending us such beautiful fan art. It was nice that we got to showcase some in our video first that we posted today. So if you haven't seen that yet, make sure you go and watch it. We do want to start showcasing it in every video again. So as soon as we're not sick and we're fully recovered we'll definitely be doing that as well and also showcasing more of our channel members because we really appreciate you as well guys absolutely little beans thank you so much to everybody who supports us in any way that you do it whether it's just watching the videos leaving likes commenting channel members whatever you are thank you so much for all of your love and support and also you guys i'm really hoping to get back into live streaming in some capacity very soon both hopefully occasionally on youtube but also mainly on my twitch so make sure you've gone and followed my twitch the link is down below and you will obviously get a notification if you turn them on when i go live but i'll also let you guys know on my discord and in my community tab on youtube I'm hoping to start streaming again soon and hopefully when my voice isn't so bad I'll actually be able to talk for more than five minutes without having a coughing fit and then I'll be able to actually share some gameplay with you guys for at least an hour or two on Twitch. Anyways, we are going to talk a little bit about the summer update today and everything that is coming very, very soon. It's been a while since we've been able to get excited about a new update since the last time we had an update, you guys, was way back at the beginning of April. So the last time we were able to actually be hyped about an update was like through February and March. And before that, obviously, there was the various updates we had then. But since then, we've literally had no big updates in the game and no tea and nothing to be excited about. So it's nice for us to have something to be hyped about that's coming very soon. Also, on a random note, does anybody know why my character occasionally when I'm stood on these wooden planks just like glitches in place? If Every now and again you'll see it happening and it's really annoying that I just did it right then and I'm trying to figure out why it's doing it because I'm not stood in the middle of the wood or anything. So if anybody knows why this is happening and how to fix it, please let me know. I feel like I'm always asking you guys to help me fix these weird glitches that I get and I'm starting to wonder, is Royal High just always glitchy for everyone or is it just me? Have I done something wrong? Because I don't remember it being this glitchy but every now and again I have really strange animation glitches and it's kind of annoying so let me know in the comments if you know how to fix them anyways let's talk about everything we know so far for this new summer update so as i'm sure you guys will remember the update was originally announced to us by Callan a little bit ago probably around the end of last month with a tweet that said busy queen at ready the teddy this is the screenshot that was included in that tweet and it showcased ready who was laying out some placeholder items in a world and also a dolphin and we still don't really know what's going on with the whole dolphin thing but i definitely think that was an early indication that whatever we're going to be getting is definitely going to be beach themed in some way i can't see a dolphin being in a swimming pool you guys so i definitely think that the summer update is going to be more focused around the beach and i really am hoping that that dolphin is not just a flirty and then we're going to actually be able to have moving alive dolphins in the water because the only alive thing that we actually have that moves around in royal high is the butterfly and I think it would be really really cool to have more wildlife that is actually alive in the game It'd make it feel a little bit more lively and feel like you're a bit less alone when you're playing in private servers especially And I just think it would make the water and 
all the other places in the game just feel a little bit more alive if we had actual sea creatures in them and things like that. And I mean, dolphins isn't where we should stop. We should have fish and all sorts as well, you guys. I know moving fish was one of the requests that you guys made towards Kalin. And I do think that Kalin actually said that he would like to do that. So fingers crossed we're going to have more actually moving animals very soon. Shortly after that, you guys will remember the proper announcement that came from Vianchi about the new summer update. He tweeted out these three hashtags, which were Royal High, Roblox Dev, and obviously a tag for Night Barbie. The screenshot included in his tweets was this one, which obviously says Summer 2021 XOXO Christmas Crew. And obviously you guys know the Christmas Crew is the people who originally started by making the Christmas update. And they've been continually called the Christmas Crew through every update since then, even if it's not Christmas they're specifically working on. And obviously that crew has been Vianchi, Kalin, Jam Jam, Ready the Teddy, and X Choker. And obviously some other devs have included their work in bits and bobs. Obviously Beism helped at Christmas. And we know that Pure Sweetener has done some things and obviously we know Urshanobs is helping with the update for summer as well and then Barbie and obviously the other scripters like Ice also have input too but it's really exciting to know that these devs are still working on more updates together we maybe need to work on a new name that's not Christmas Crew since it's not been Christmas for a while now but then again to be fair in Vianchi's head I think it's always Christmas and I think he's still already planning the next Christmas update you guys so I'm sure it's going to be an exciting one since he's had so much time to think about what he wants it to be. Shortly after, we also got a tweet from Kalin that said, I've been seeing a lot of misinformation, so I'll make this clear. The summer update is not coming on June 1st, which I mean, you guys should probably know that by now. June 1st was the summer shop opening again, so all of the shop items from previous summer updates were made available again for you to buy. The summer update itself for this year is going to come later. So that could be the towards the end of June, it could be the start of July. I have a feeling it's going to be July and August where the summer update is, because I don't think the school's going to be done in time for August. I I mean, we can dream, and I'm sure lots of people are going to spread lots of misinformation about when the summer update is going to come, obviously, for the new school. But we're just going to have to wait and see. We don't have any dates for anything. In true Royal High fashion, it just comes when it's ready and when it's done. Now, one piece of tea I didn't actually share with you guys was this tea here from Adriana, or Adrivana. I don't know how to say that properly, but I have a feeling it's probably Adriana with one of those weird letter changes in the middle where people put Vs or Qs and things for a reason I'm still unaware of. But there was three screenshots here from a chat inside of one of the servers you guys and I actually missed this but have a look specifically at what Kalin has said in these screenshots. As you guys can see Kalin said firstly I'm so excited for summer. We did the first layout yesterday so the first layout for the new summer update was done the other day. Kalin also said I don't model enough to make a set after somebody asked would you ever consider making a set. I think it was the person that actually shared this originally that asked but obviously Kalin doesn't make sets you guys. He's not a modeler. He is a scripter so it's very unlikely i think that Kalin will ever make a set in the game and also you guys Kalin also said the new school is not coming with the summer update there does seem to be some confusion there you guys but the summer update is not going to be the new school it is its own update entirely also Kalin did say i don't know if urshan's set is coming and I didn't know that Urshan was working on a set, you guys. Have I been sleeping under a rock or something? Can someone share this with me? Because clearly I have missed this out and I would be really interested to know what this is all about because Urshan making a new set would be pretty exciting. Then obviously, you guys, we got a little bit more news about the summer update, which I guess details a little bit more about what we can expect. One tweet that Kalin sent out definitely got some replies that we know has helped to clarify some of the new things coming to the update. Kalin originally tweeted, is there anything you have ever wanted in Royal High that I could make. In brackets, not accessories. Mainly because obviously he's not a modeler, but also because we now know Urshanobs is the one making the accessories for the update. So for example, he said things like footstep sounds. I want to make a lot of cool things for summer. And one of the replies we got that really stuck out was this one. As you can see, Sned said being able to build sandcastles would be cool. Kalin responded, I've been begged to make this by Meg. I cry now in pain because it's very hard, but I must try to do it for Meg. So in other words, you guys, we've basically had confirmation that as long as Kalin can figure out how to do it, we are going to have some kind of mini game or system to build sandcastles in the game, which personally I think is very exciting and I'm really looking forward to seeing how that plays out. 
And as well, you guys, don't forget that Ready the Teddy tweeted, Dear Roblox Designers, drop some summer clothes, swimsuits, beachwear, etc. below, or Canada 4th of July themed clothes if you would if you may have them as well. Looking for some clothes for Royal High. So you guys, I think it's pretty obvious that they are definitely working on a beach update if they're also asking for beach themed clothes. I do want to talk to you about outfits in a different video because Kitzilla has been tweeting a lot about outfit related things, but definitely in this update video, it's definitely important to remember that there are going to be a bunch of new outfits, both pride themed ones, beach themed ones, things like that. And I definitely think it's pretty obvious that this is going to be a beach themed update based on all of the pictures we have seen. Don't forget as well that Jam Jam also tweeted her own tea with pictures of things like palm trees and stuff like that blared out in the background, which make it pretty obvious that we're going to get some kind of beach. And obviously you're going to need a beach if you're going to be building sandcastles. So I think the update kind of speaks for itself, but there will be lots that they implement. I'm sure that we won't be able to anticipate. I mean, we have a beach house right now. We have Sunset Island, but the only time we've ever had an actual beach run was back when we had the Diamond Beach that lobby that we logged into in the old school system that we had a really, really long time ago now, you guys. So it's going to be exciting to have a dedicated beach if that's what's actually happening, and I'm really looking forward to it. As always, I'm sure you guys are super hyped just as much as I am. And I'd love to know what your opinions are and your hype levels are as well, so let me know in the comments down below. And of course, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I do want to say, you guys, I am going to put out some videos from tomorrow that are not just all about the summer update. I have one more video that I want to post today about the outfit. And then tomorrow, I will talk to you about any tea that comes out. But I also want to share some more concepts and things again because the community has been really, really creating some beautiful concepts. I'm mainly just glad to be back on a regular uploading schedule on this channel. My first step to getting back to normal has been achieved. So now I just need to start working on feeling better and then getting back to streaming and making content on the other two channels as well. Thank you so much for watching as always. I love you guys lots and I'll see you all in the next video, little beans. Bye-bye.